This is a Rutke Mods video. Hello, I'm Greg Rutke of Rutke Mods, and I thought I would give you guys a little tip. If you are running boot camp on your Mac and have a Broadcom Wi-Fi chip, if you are running Windows 10, for instance, and you are connected to a encrypted Wi-Fi network, you may have noticed that even if you do connect to the internet, your internet speeds are extremely painfully slow. And even if you do have internet connection, eventually the connection gets so weak that it just gives up on trying to load anything. The reason for this is because of Microsoft's updated Wi-Fi drivers for some Broadcom Wi-Fi chips. I don't know if this affects all Broadcom Wi-Fi chips, but Microsoft's drivers for some of them, including the Wi-Fi chip that's in my 2009 MacBook, do not work with this driver. The driver is usually updated every time Windows goes through a major revision, like the anniversary update that happened earlier this month. The only way to get your internet to work properly again is to actually install official Broadcom drivers. And these drivers can be from either your bootcamp install files or possibly from Broadcom if they actually supply them for your chip. I'm not too sure about that. I just install mine from the bootcamp files. I have already had my original driver installed one time before. So I can just go to update driver, browse computer for driver software, let me pick from a list, and choose the Broadcom driver and click Next. And presto, I have my Broadcom driver and my internet finally works fully again. Like I said earlier, the only thing you need to do is get the files from your respective boot camp drivers and you're all set. And that is the way to fix your internet connection problems in Windows 10 if you have a Broadcom chip. Thank you for watching. This has been a Rutke Mods video.